the team is an interesting story. It's only eight months old and it came out of nothing. Nothing is the Israeli cycling situation. And uh, eight months ago, an Israeli rider that had a dream to get to the Tour de France and unfortunately failed with his dream, although he got to Saxo Bank, uh, did something else. He decided that he'll try to get Israeli riders and uh, some other young riders that don't have a chance from other countries. And he will maybe bring those guys to the Tour de France that he couldn't have. So he found the Israeli businessman that was willing and amazingly to put some money of his own fund and realize the dream. So they, uh, with Peter Sagan as a special ambassador, uh, founded the team. And the team is uh, competing since January and doing uh, pretty well. And who are some of the riders we should watch out for in Colorado this week? Definitely number one is Dan Turek. He's a Czech, 22 years old, uh, a very, very, very aggressive rider. Won two stages this year in, in, in major stages in uh, Azerbaijan and the Tour of Berlin with the same style, breakaways. He's a very, uh, he goes for breakaways whenever he's a chance and he, and he survived them for a long, very long periods. Listen, I'm, I'm not going to hide that it's uh, we are a little bit under pressure here. You know that uh, we got. I'm not sure that we got the criticism, but there are people that are saying, "Why is that Israeli team getting a chance to compete in the United States when there are American teams that are, were not invited?" Uh, well, I think we legitimately were invited. We are a good team, uh, but uh, I know that uh, that we are under pressure to perform. And that's the goal, to perform, uh, to put a mark on the race and not just come and participate on, and sit on wheels.